Madhavia Arabic, Madhui Madawi or Madhavism, is a Mahdist Muslim sect founded by Syed Muhammad Janpuri in India in the late 15th century. Syed Muhammad declared himself to be Imam Mahdi at the holy city of Mecca, in front of the Kaaba in 1496 and is revered as such by the Madhavia community throughout the world and Zikri Madhavis in Baluchistan. <laughs> Beliefs Madhavia Madhavia Muslims are found in most parts of India, Pakistani provinces of Sindh and Baluchistan, Farah in Afghanistan, Khorasan in Iran, besides some parts of Central Asian countries. Madhavis believe in oneness of Allah, the prophethood of Muhammad as the last messenger of Allah, and the Quran as their holy book. They strictly adhere to the five pillars of Islam, Sunnah tradition, and Sharia, while having high respect and reverence for the House of Muhammad and his immediate progeny al -e -bayt, the Rashidun Caliphs, and the companions of Muhammad Sahaba. Madhavis also respect all four schools of Islamic jurisprudence, but widely follow the traditions similar to Hanafi jurisprudence. They offer prayers five times a day led by their murshids, or spiritual guides, fast during Ramadan, offer special thanks on Dugana Laylat al Qadr past midnight between 26 and 27 Ramadan, perform Hajj, and pay zakat. They also attach great significance to zikr, remembrance of Allah, after dawn farj prayers, and in the evening after Asr prayer. Madhavis, besides following the five pillars of Islam, also follow the seven obligations of sainthood, known as faris e walaya Muhammadiya. These obligations are, renunciation tark -e -dunya, quest for divine vision talab didar -e company of truthfuls and ascetics sobath -e -sadikin, migration hijra, retreat and solitude uzlath -az -kalk, absolute dependence on Allah tawakal, constant remembrance of Allah zikr -e and distributing tithe USHR. Followers of Janpuri strictly follow some of these obligations in their day-to-day -day life. Most of them initiate renunciation in the advanced stage of their lives, after getting retirement from the jobs or by handing over business to their heirs. Their renunciation is in any way not related to celibacy, because almost all of them get married. Muhammad Janpuri declared himself to be promised Mahdi, and as such a caliph of Allah. He claimed to teach the true inner meaning of the Quran and strictly adhere to the Sunnah of Muhammad. Janpuri's declaration was ignored by the ulema of Mecca, but after he repeated his declaration in Ahmedabad, Gujarat, he gained a group of followers and established a line of caliphs who led the movement after his death. After Janpuri's demise in 1505, the Madhavi movement went through a militant phase, lasting during the reign of the first five Madhavi caliphs. The movement was persecuted under the Sultan Muzaffar Shah II r. 1511 of Gujarat Sultanate. The second Madhavi Caliph, Bandagi Mian Syed Khand Mir and his Fukra disciples the persons who renounce the world and keep remembering Allah with zikr, faced organized persecution by the regime of Muzaffar at the behest of his court-appointed mullahs and was killed in 1523 along with hundreds of unarmed and peaceful disciples. Syed Khand Mir's tomb is located in the town of Champaner in the Panchmahal district of the western Indian state Gujarat, where thousands of seekers and followers, from different parts of India and other countries, arrive to pay tribute. After failure to reappear in that year, the movement lost much of its fervour and entered a «quietist» phase, which lasted throughout the 17th century. In the 18th century, the movement mostly died out in northern India. After the 1799 siege of Seringapatam, the British government invited the Madhavis to resettle in Mysore. <inaudible> Madhavis Zikris are an offshoot of the Madhavi movement found mostly in the Baluchistan region of western Pakistan. They too follow Prophet Muhammad, the five pillars of Islam, and offer namaz prayers in the common mosques like the Hanafi Muslims, but with the condition that the Imam must also be of Madhavi belief. The content of their prayer, which they call Zikr e Elahi, refers to the worship of God. In addition to the Hajj, Zikris also visit Ziyarat to the Ko e Murad. Mountain of Desire. In Balochi, where their promised Imam al Mahdi Syed Muhammad Janpuri is believed to have stayed, and in 1504 AD, he offered two rakiyas cycles special thanksgiving prayers Dugana Laylathul Qadr in the midnight of 27th Ramadan 908 Hijri. Following his tradition, including Zikris, all Madhavis offer Dugna Laylathul Qadr prayers on 27th Ramadan midnight every year, under the leadership of their Murshid. 
Thus, Madhavis are a sect who follow the Sufi order, defined by the medieval saint Syed Muhammad Janpuri of the capital city of the Sharqi dynasty. This city was also known as the Shiraz of the East, due to its academic and intellectual eminence and the presence of many Islamic scholars in that era. The number of Madhavis is not known with any confidence. Gall stated that they were "...estimated to number over 750,000 people." While the United States Senate Committee on Foreign Relations in 2004 stated that there were approximately 200,000. The Madhavis form a local majority in Pakistan's Gwadar district. And there are sizable communities in Karachi, the Pakistani part of Makran, Lasbela district, and Kheda, and in Pakistan's Sindh province. Their concentration in urban Karachi is due to many Madhavis having relocated to the city, especially the neighborhood of Lyari town, with the general rise of Islamic extremism and jihadism in the region since the 1980s, Madhavis have been discriminated against, targeted, and killed by Sunni militants in Pakistan. As a result, the Madhavis community has been shrinking and becoming less visible, with many killed by the Sunni Hanafi. Non-governmental organizations including the Human Rights Commission of Pakistan HRCP are working with local activists to create a greater awareness of the Madhavi's predicament. Recently, police protection has been provided to some Madhavi's pilgrims. Many Madhavis have been killed by Sunni and terrorist during fasting in Ramadan. The persecution of Madhavis by Sunni militants as of 2014 has been part of the larger backlash against religious minorities in Pakistani Baluchistan, targeting Hindus, Hazaras, Shias, and Zikris, resulting in the migration of over 300,000 Shias, Zikris, and Hindus from Pakistani Baluchistan. The persecutions were due both to banned militant organizations such as Lashka i Jangvi and Pakistani Taliban. Topic Madhavia community in India Anjuman e Madhavia is a Madhavia community centre in Hyderabad, Telangana, India, established in 1902. L. K. A. Iyer in 1930 reports the existence of a community of Madhavia Muslims in Mysore Dhanabagata, Chanapatna, Karugavalu. There is a village named by Dhanabagata in Karnataka, large groups of Medavis residing in Gurat, Rajasthan, Maharashtra, Tamil Nadu, Karnataka Bengaluru, etc. Topic see also Anjuman e Madhavia Topic Others who claim to be Mahdi Ahmed ibn Abi Mahali ibn Tumart Mirza Ghulam Ahmad Mirza Hussain Ali Nuri Muhammad Ahmad Saeed Ali Muhammad Shirazi Topic References Topic Other sources Ziaula Yadalahi Trans. Malid Sharif Jamiat e Madhavia, Bangalore. 2007. Azhar Munir, I. A. Rahman. Zikris in the Light of History and Their Religious Beliefs, Izersons, 1998. <laughs> <laughs> External links Madhavia. Madhavia Times. Khalifatullah Mehdi. Hazrat Muhammad Nuruddin Arabi Sahib. Madhaviyat in the light of sayings of Imamana. Madhaviya Foundation. Jamiat e Madhaviya, Bangalore.